Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good day. Hope you're all having an amazing day today. My name is Lex and welcome back to my summer car. In the previous video, I did nothing. I just sort of got lost, um, forgot to change up a gear. You guys were very angry about that one. Uh, I think I just forgot to do it again as well, just there, which was, which was nice. I'm, I'm sure that's not going to bother anyone. And... I asked you guys to just let me know about this game in the comment section, and you guys told me quite a lot of stuff. As it turns out, can I get out with it left on? Oh, that's cool. That's nice. Even the handbrake's just left off. That's fine. It's not rolling away. Apparently, all of this is mine. I, for some reason, sort of saw this building and just naturally thought neighbor, but of course this isn't a house, is it? This is just a, sh a shed. It's like a, a garage sort of thing. And it's all, it's all ours. All of this, the tractor is ours, this truck is ours, this trailer is ours. But the thing is, I also learnt from you guys that apparently I turned this on to permakill. And I'm not sure if I want to do this let's play as a mortal. As you can see in the top left, it does actually say mortal. I hadn't really understood that this would be a thing. So, what I thought I'd do to start off this video is I'm going to go and kill myself um, just to sort of end this game. And then we're going to start from fresh, just all brand new everything, you know, a van that's got a windscreen again, all that sort of stuff. And I'm going to try and actually play the game properly. Now I understand more what we've got to do, I understand where the shop is, I understand that we can use those things for our job somehow. Uh, now that we've got all this sort of information... It's, you know, uh, I feel that we can start doing this series. And, of course, all the bits that I still don't know you guys can easily teach me in the comment section. Look at how much faster we're going. See, I I took the piss out of the van to start off with. Here we go. Come on, die. 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 That's not enough to kill me? Right, so I didn't kill myself, and I lost my van, and I'm in the middle of nowhere. Can I not just tip this back? Can I? Is that not something I can do? Am I going to have to get my truck and, like, push this over? It's actually still in gear, I think. Oh my god, this is even all spinning. Look at the detail in this. That's amazing. The drive shafts are still spinning. The wheels are still going absolutely crazy. That's fantastic. But I, I can't I can't tip this over. Oh, I can open the door, though. That's pretty fun. Can't get in, though. That's that's it now. Oh, I can get in. Oh. <laughs> that's great. That That's amazing. Right, let me, let me just sort of... Can I actually reach the ignition? Here we go. Hang on. There we go. Let's just, uh... That, that was... That didn't go as well as I'd hoped. Hang on, I'm gonna try and run back. Weren't we driving for ages? Wait, can I drown? Let's try and drown myself. I just want to kill myself and restart this with uh, a, a more immortal character. Because I think mortality is not something I want in this game. Although, maybe dying is quite hard. If we didn't even die from that, maybe it takes quite a lot to die but i don't want to risk it so let's see if we can just go for a nice little swim here it's not that deep does it get deeper oh okay we can't even drown this this is not turning out how i was hoping okay so actually another way i just thought is apparently when we get our stats maxed out to the top we do actually die and when you punch too much you get really thirsty so i'm going to assume that if i just keep walking and punching the air eventually i will die of thirst that that's my that's my thinking, anyway, so far. <laughs> it's not doing anything again. Wow, a million ways... Oh, there we go. We finally died from fist punching the air. It's all in... Oh, no, hang on, there is a bit in English. Young man dead from dehydration. Back, there we go. Right, let's start a new game. And let's go to permanent death and turn that off. Okay? Let's start this again. Surname 8. First name... Figure, figure eight, and begin. And I got the achievement of I am coward. I admit it, I'm a coward. But do you know what? I don't want to put in loads of effort because I've I've done a little bit of reading up. I admit, after I said I wasn't going to, I sort of admitted defeat and realized that I was going to have to read up a bit of it. And plus, you guys told me quite a lot of stuff. I realized that this game is really time consuming. There is a lot of stuff to do because we've got to build the car and. It's, it seems slightly less like the one that's in um, Car Mechanic Simulator. Because this stuff, it doesn't seem to have much instruction on how everything goes in. And plus, when I put the uh, seat in in the back of the car in the previous episode, apparently you actually have to bolt that in as well. There should actually be like a box of bolts or something like that. Hang on, there's a toolbox here. 
that we can open somehow. How do we open this? Hang on, if we, uh, nope. How do we, oh god, I can't, oh, here we go. This, it's gonna be this again, isn't it? I can't even open the bloody toolbox. Really? Really? Oh my god. <laughs> Hang on, let's have a look at the controls here. Uh, equip items, use items, F. Well, can't I just use F? Oh, I was pressing F at the wrong time. Okay. And it's actually glitching through my lights. Let me just move that out of the way. So we actually have a bunch of spanners, screwdrivers, and all that sort of stuff. I believe there's bolts somewhere or other. And we also build the engine on this worktop as well, and then we crane it in. So much to do. Yeah, I don't think it is like... Hang on, let's just try and put this in. See if this is like on Car Mechanic Simulator. It doesn't seem to be as... No. Normally, like, the, the part is already outlined, whereas this one seems to just... Yeah. I don't know. I, I guess that's not even upside down. Hang on, can I... I can rotate. Oh my god. This is crazy. Crazy detailed and difficult. Maybe we just can't put that on yet. Maybe that's why. Look, I want to I wanna put it on. Oh, no, hang on. There was a tick I just saw. Oh, that's really sort of abstract because you just have to look at the right part to get the tick and the tick's gone again i can't i can't get the tick up again oh that is that is annoying Ugh, no hang on let me just put this down because what we want to do first of all is to close this all up can we close that there we go close this all up i think we have to like hold it down to be here and lock I, I don't know i've also been told to uh pull the cable out for the phone so I'm going to do that. So apparently we don't want phone calls. Apparently they're just annoying. So we won't bother about that. Now, we need to go to the shops because we need to get loads of food, loads of drink, because all we've got is like that pack of beers and that's not enough. And then we have to order just a huge amount of parts, things like oil and everything else. And we should be able to buy all of that with the money that we're given to start off with. So let's jump in and go... Hang on, let's just shut this door. There we go. Driving mode. Ignition. Oh, wow, this isn't... Is it, is it broken? Hang on, let me just give it some revs. Wow, okay, there we go. We're finally going. Handbrake off. First gear. Whew. Whoa, drifting. Whoa, okay, don't... Woo. That was almost drift straight into the bedroom. Let's try not to do that again. Okay, so I'm actually... Everyone was telling me to change up a gear. But do you know what? I think that anything more than the second gear is probably too fast for this road. Because it's just a really shitty road and you could easily just crash. And I don't want this thing toppled over because I don't know how to get it back again. If actually, if you guys know how I could have got that van back upright again in the previous game, let me know. Because uh, I'd have had no idea. So I was actually talking about something a minute ago before we got in the van. And it's completely gone from my head. But I think basically what I was saying is the plan is to just go to the shop. And just, just grab as much stuff as possible. There's also all the tuning parts and everything else. But they're going to cost loads of money. And that's why you have to do your job as well. But if I just get us all stocked up on drinks and food and things like oil. Stuff that we need. Um... All of these things. I don't actually know exactly what to buy. Apparently some of the stuff in the shop is not worth buying either. Because it does, doesn't have a use in the game. At least not yet. So we have to be careful about what we buy. So I'm guessing just anything mechanical related. And anything food and consumption related. So that we can go back home and start building the car. Wow I forgot just how long this road is. I think the end is just up there. I love the scale of this though because it, it's a really big map. There's not much going on. There doesn't seem to be that many roads because this is just sort of like a few back roads and then the main bit. But it's got a huge sense of scale to it. It actually takes quite a while to get anywhere. And I sort of like that because, you know, it just makes it a bit more realistic. But at the same time, I don't because time and I'm lazy. Uh, and there's no barrier, so we have to manually check. I assume that there is actually no trains in this game. Maybe you guys can answer that. Are there trains in this game? Should I be slowing down for that or do I just ignore it? I'm sure you guys can tell me. Right, so as we're coming up onto this sign, I could also run past the other mistake I made in the previous video. I turn left. The reason I turned left was because I just liked the name. Turns out there was a clue as to which one was the best one to go to because Rehapur is only a mile away or kilometer away. 
Whereas Loppy was three kilometers away. So I didn't actually reach Loppy in the end. It was further than where we turned. Because we like tried to turn back at the train tracks. Which wasn't far enough to even get to Loppy. So obviously the idea was we were supposed to go this way. Oh my god, that road is a bit curved. Ooh, be careful now. I don't want a crash van. Because as I pointed out, I don't actually know how to fix this. We do have a radio though. Can I, uh... How do I, how do, I do this? How do I enable... Do I press F? No, I can't seem to figure out the radio. I should probably look where I'm going. No, I, d I don't think I can get that. Oh, Tuna, hang on. Uh, do I do something with... I don't know. Apparently, you can scroll, and that, like, turns knobs and stuff, but I, I can't see anything working, so I'm just going to assume I'm an idiot. Right, so hoping that I haven't just driven past the thing whilst playing with the radio. I don't think I have. This up here, what's this building here? Is this the shop, or is this just a house? There's a lot of... This looks like marshland. I don't like the colour of that field. No, I think that's just a house. We're going to keep going then. Maybe it's that building over there is going to be the town. I'm looking for a shop. This is the building that we want to get to. And by the way, no, I'm not changing up the third because I'm scared I'm going to crush my van. We're just... Whoa, as it is. In second... Whoa, 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 whoa. See, look. I don't want to be... There's this... Sorry for the distortion. <laughs> I should probably move back from my microphone a little bit. Oh, God. Yes, yeah, so I should probably not try to push this thing. Is there going to be a train on this one as well? I can't actually see... Oh, mind you, I can lean over, can't I? Oh, yeah, leaning. Ooh, nice. Like it. Can we actually go through there? I'm sure we'll, we'll find that out again at some point. Not in this video, though. But maybe we'll go for a little drive down there and see what... Whoa! Down there. Yeah, I should not try to sp sort of speed this thing up because I think it might actually make it longer in the long run if I end up crashing and not knowing how to get back again. Now, there is actually a hitchhike button. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no! No! You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me right now. Really? Hang on. Well, actually, the at least the... Uh, at least that's still intact. Okay, nope. I was on about this. Hang on. At least that was still intact. <laughs> I, guess, I guess it doesn't matter anymore, does it? Because actually, that's quite curious, I'm below the world. Oh, wh whoa. Right, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be recovering my car from the bottom of a lake, even below the... Yeah. That's not happening, is it? <sighs> Remember what I was saying about don't go fast because... It makes it longer in the long run. Well, we're 17 minutes into this recording and we've done nothing again. We've done nothing. This game is so frustrating. <laughs> so, so what now? There is a hitchhike button, isn't there? The hitchhike is O. But I mean, ugh, there's no cars here. I'm just going to assume that this next village is up here. Hang on, is there anything else? Is there like a mo mobile phone button or anything? No, there's just a button to swear and a button to push and hit. Finger? What's that? Oh. <laughs> oh, that's great. Yeah, well, I guess that's how I feel about my van right now. Yeah, bit River. You dork of the pussy. I love these finished things. They're amazing. Isn't there a sprint button that isn't actually enabled from the start run? Left shift. Oh, apparently it is. Well, it could have fooled me. Because that does not feel like running. You could do a little better than that, Mr. Don't know what the character's name is. I think I'm just going to have to start this game again, aren't I? Okay. And we're back again. Let me just shut this door. There we go. Right, let's give this a, th a third try. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, actually, one, two, three. No, this would be the fourth try. Okay, so I've just had an idea. Seems like we crossed tracks up the other end. I thought, instead of taking that road, it might be safer for us to just take this grass path alongside the train track, and I'm assuming this will take us to the place we want to go. Or at least we can get back to that crossroads that we met before. So I'm hoping we can actually go through tunnels. I'm actually going to go in the third. Hopefully this will be quicker because... Oh, look how much faster this is. This is so much better than taking the road. I guess this is sort of cheating. But do you know what? It's already in the game. And, well, we've already driven that way once. That that That's enough, right? I just hope that we can not crash into those trees because that's a bit... Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was a nice jump. Oh, look. 
look, there's the other building that we drove past earlier. And there should be a road just up here. I'm just going to downshift. I don't want to go too fast. Look, well, we didn't even go for the tunnel. So maybe the tunnel is just what denotes the end of the map and maybe there's nowhere to go. So now we can go this way. And I'm actually going to go into first gear. And I'm just going to drive in first. Because second gear is just too much and I don't want to fall down into a ravine again. I, I can't cope with the stress of having to do this all again. Well, it didn't take too long. Now we're 22 minutes in, for those of you counting. Uh, well, the recording anyway. The video is obviously going to be cut down somewhat. Just to know how, how long this recording's been where I've done absolutely nothing again. But apparently you guys seem to think that doing nothing and being angry at this game is just part of this game's charm. So I'm just going to just fly with it and just... Because actually, that first video that you saw, I was going to scrap it. I was actually just going to just chuck the thing away. And then you guys on Twitter told me that actually that's that's just the game. <laughs> just being angry at the game is just the game. Loads of other YouTubers had the same thing. Do you know, I'm going to go into second gear and just try and the crash. He says as he sort of veers off the road slightly. <laughs> oh, well, there's a road down there and I didn't look to see if there was a shop. So I'm just going to keep following this road and hope there was nothing of interest down there. Nice looking road though. This road's a bit sketchy because there's just a big massive drop on one side now that goes into water. Good God, this is supposed to be one kilometre away? This this actually feels like one... No, this feels longer than one kilometre. I just I drove a few kilometres earlier just to get my dinner and it did not feel like this long. Or I guess maybe it was. Maybe this is like life's life size map. I don't know. Is this... A village? This looks... There's a bit more tree stuff going on here. It's filling me with hope that we might have something. No, it's just more trees. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, I can't see over that brow, which is scaring me. I see buildings. I see buildings. Or at least I just saw red, which I'm going to assume. Oh, there's a building. Oh, there's a big building. Oh, please tell me this is it. There's a barn. There's a big building down there. Is this it? Have we actually managed to get there to the town? Oh my god, what is this building here? Is this it? No, this is that's not it. Hang on, I don't think this is it. Let me just pull in in case this is it. I don't think this is it. Let's just get out of here. We don't, we don't need to... Actually, we probably should worry about the handbrake. Just in case the van does roll away. I don't want any more problems with this. So what's this? This is just some guy's farm. Can't go in. Can't do anything like that. No, this this isn't it. This is not the place. Right, let's just get back in here. Oh, by, uh, by the way, um, you guys have told me that jumping through the roof of the car is perfectly normal. So, I'm just going to go ahead and do that myself. Right, handbrake down. If I can actually... There we go. And let's go for first gear. Well, still on our journey to find the village. Two videos in. Maybe, maybe third video in. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, no, I see signs. Oh, my God, is that a massive quarry? There's a lot of stuff over there. Okay, what do these signs say? That one says some words. Oh, my God, this is an actual road. Hang on. Can I get out without the car rolling away? Let's just have a look here. Okay, we're good. So, this sign says that's the way to lop into... Oh, lop it is now five. Hang on. If at that turning, loppy was three kilometers away and now it's five but the thing that we were supposed to go to was one kilometer away i have a feeling i've missed a turn unless the shop just wasn't at that town so the only other option is to go left to lenta kento lenta kenta lenta kenta so there's nothing this way well, at least we've got tarmac, which is which is lovely, because we've been driving on that shitty road for way too long. I think this is going to be another We're Lost episode. I said that I did some reading up, but I didn't learn where the shop is. I wanted that to still be a surprise. Right. Let's go down here. Oh, it's so nice. Look at this big road. This is beautiful. Oh, what's this down here? This is... A big... This is a big road! Okay, so that's the way to Rupakohonya, which is where I thought the thing is. This is a big road. 
Whoa. Uh, I, I guess turn right and just keep going. There's even a bus stop if we do crash. I assume there are other cars. Apparently there are other cars on the road, but I have no clue about it. We've yet to see another person... Another. Actually, no, we have seen a couple of people sitting down, didn't we, in the previous video? But apart from that, no other cars, no other signs of humanity. Oh, look, there's the lake on the right. Have we really just not got that far? Oh, my God. Well, it's nice to be able to go fast and not have to worry about falling off the side into a ravine again. Still no sign of a town. Oh my god, we're now doing 100 kilometers and it feels like we are going warp speed. Can we actually get, we actually have a fourth? Oh my god, I also need to worry about fuel. Do you know, I've just had a feeling, well there was a right turn to go somewhere there, I did not read that because, oh god, I could feel it drifting. Okay, let's slow down and just go into third gear here. There's a turning right, where does this take us? Hang on, is this, is this it? Hang on, what does this sign say? This sign says Perjervi. Perjervi. <laughs> I'm never going to be able to read these. Oh. Do you know what? I'm going to go down here. Hang on, there seems to be more. Oh, look. Oh, we're entering a town. <gasps> Is this it? Are you shitting me right now? We're actually here. And just as we've got here, I just suddenly thought that I think... Someone said we were supposed to... Oh, there's another another car. Oh, my God. Apparently, we were supposed to have taken some fuel cans to fill up with fuel. Which I didn't do. So... <sighs> what a journey. I feel exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we can fill the truck up with fuel whilst we're here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna move back and actually just fill this up with fuel. There we go. I'm just gonna park this haphazardly. Turn her off. Jump out. Oh, look at all these buildings. Ah, oh, I'm so exhausted. Oh, here's the thing. One of them's diesel. One of them's petrol. I'm going to assume this is diesel. Can I hear? Can you hear that? Is that a storm? I've got some dark clouds seem to loom. I swear I just heard thunder. <gasps> there's a car! There's a car! Oh my god, look, there's a car! Oh, it's so exciting. Why can't we just live here? I don't want to have to deal with the drive to get all the way here just to... Right, I'm just going to assume that we have diesel. Here we go. Oh, I need to take the cap off, don't we? God's sake. All right, here we go. I'm actually using the scroll wheel. There we go. She's off. Now we can put in... That really sounds like thunder. That's got me worried. Here we go. How do we, uh, how do we do this? Oh god, it's getting darker. Or is that just because night time's just happening? It's taking us a whole day to get here. Maybe that's why. I'm not entirely sure how this thing works either. I guess stand there. Fine. I thought we might have to click a button or something, but apparently you just have to point it there. So I just thought. I could technically drive away right now. <laughs> what would happen? I don't know. Let's just screw that back up. Oh, that's nice. That's, that's a nice detail. I like that. And close this somehow. How do I... Oh my god, there's a... <gasps> there's a bus! Oh my god, how exciting! Hang on, does that mean that if we... Hang on, there was no bus stops near us though, was there? Buses don't come to where we live. Oh, if only we could get the bus here instead of having to worry about all this bullshit. Okay, I can't figure it out. Oh, there we go. It's getting dark. I'm getting worried. There's a really nice car over here. Check this car out. All right, dude. Whoa, hey, this is... Oh. is... Is he swearing at me? <laughs> Smell of shit, dude. That's a nice car, though. Is this what we're building? No, this isn't what we're building. It's pretty nice. <laughs> you truly are a water dick. Come here and show me that finger of yours. Dick of a pussy. <laughs> this is great. There's a pub here. Right, I think this is the shop. The Taimon Kaupa. Inside here. 
Oh, look. Good day. Is it that? You need to say that many words to say good day? Tourists don't buy milk, they buy beer, and milk goes sour. That's how I sell. Um, right, fan belt, brake clutch fluid. I'll get a couple of those. A couple of coolants, a couple of motor oils. Then we need um, mosquito spray. Yes, because I'm sick of that mosquito sound. Um, we want some homo hyperclean, or maybe we don't. Sponges, milk. Uh, no, we want beer. Nice case of beer. There we go. Get a couple of those. Uh, potato chips. I'll just buy all of them. <laughs> uh, juice concentrate. We'll get a, a couple of those for when we don't fancy being drunk. Uh, yeast. Uh, yeah, apparently yeast, sugar, and stuff we don't need yet because you can't do any cooking or anything. But that might be something for the future. And... Uh, what have we got here? Oh, pizza. Grab some pizza. Uh, macaroni box, sausage. And I guess that's it. Total price, 1700 Oh, boy. Right, hang on. So we've now got to carry all of this to the car. Thank you for visiting. Thank you. Yeah, well, it's going to take me a lot of in and out to actually get this all into the van. I think we might actually pull up out front. Let me just open the side door here. That is so cool. Right, let's just uh, chuck that in there. Shut that up for a second. And let's just move around to the front here. We're definitely going to be driving back by night time, I think. It's so awesome just seeing other vehicles in this game. Because we've just had so much time of just being lonely. Right, we've got this big bag of shopping. Apparently this bag is going to like explode with stuff. So it's probably best that we... Uh, throw that when we get in at home because I have a feeling it's just going to explode everywhere. I want to get into the back. Here we go. Oh my god. Look, it's getting dark. Oh god, we've literally spent an entire day. <sighs> right, there's our beers. Upside down beers. Don't even worry about it. Let's, let's just rotate it the right way. Chuck those in there. And our other case of beer. We can rotate that. I like that we can rotate that. I like that the beer bottles don't fall out either because that would be quite messy. Oh, we still got to drive back here. I don't know what's up with that guy that's just sort of hanging around. Like, is he like a like an enemy to us? Is he a villain? Is he going to attack us? Rob us? I don't know. I don't know what to expect from this game. I don't know if I should buy the rest of this, but I'm just going to buy... Can we actually pick up two things at once? No, we can't. Okay. I can hear a car moving. Oh, no, it's the bus coming back. So awesome seeing the bus. Maybe we'll see him because we're going to be driving back. See, Loppy's now only three kilometers away. Huh. So this is like complete opposite side of the map to where we live, I assume. I definitely know, though, that we need to drink something because I'm getting a little bit thirsty in this game. Apparently, everything else you have to worry about. You have to worry about going for a wee. You have to worry about eating. You have to worry about drinking. You have to worry about sleeping. Don't need to worry about uh, dirtiness, though. So let's just uh, drink a couple of brewskis just to get our thirst down. <sighs> there we go. That's nice. That's everything done, isn't it? There's nothing else we can buy. Can we go on the fruities? Oh, apparently we can. Hang on. Uh... Oh, look. Just... Oh, wow. We can actually play the fruities. Um... Go for it. Hang on. We need another one. There we go. Nothing. Um, nothing. <laughs> right, let's just spend that last one. Here we go. We've got a man. We've got another man. Ooh, is that something? No. Okay, well, we just spent some money and we lost it. Right. Okay. Well, I'll see you next time. Hang on, how do I talk to the guy? Uh, player control... I can only swear drunk speech and... Okay, you can't even talk nicely to people. Is that just the finish way? Right, here we go. Close that up. There we go. Jump in. And it's time to head home. We're now leaving whatever the hell that town is. <gasps> there's a truck! There's a car! There's a van! Oh, God, it's exciting. There's people. There's people now that it's night time, which is kind of weird. On our way home, after an eventful 41 minutes of recording so far. 
Oh man. I assume everything is is right back. I can okay, okay, I can see my step. Whoa! So it's like I can hear stuff rolling around and it's really unnerving. It makes me feel like I've done something wrong and it's all gonna fall out the back. So considering how long it's taken us just to drive to the store and buy that stuff, I have a feeling that this is gonna be a long game and a long series. <laughs> I don't know what I've got myself into, but I'm starting to have a little bit of regret, I must admit. Right, so I need to slow down here, because I think we have to turn off this road at some point. Thing is, I don't remember where we're going. I need to follow signs, yeah, back to the Rook Pahoya, yeah. Because I don't know if there's a different way to get to where we need to go. There is a map, but the map's at home, so we're going to have to wait until we get home. Right, here we go. Well, we can actually indicate, can't we? Uh... Oh, I don't know the button. Sod it. Right, let's just change down a gear. The thing I'm worried about now is that little... Well, not little. That long drive on the dirt roads home. That's the bit that scares me because it's so easy to go off the track. Right, I guess... Down this way. This is home now. All the way down this long, shitty road. Beer bottles clinking in the back. Making me feeling real, real nervous right now. I've got no headlights. I did have mosquito spray, but it's in my shopping bag, and I don't want to release the shopping bag until we're indoors, because that will be a right mess. Oh my god. That was a scary hill. I did not know what was on the other side of that. I was blind. It also doesn't help that because I'm used to driving on the right, I keep finding myself sort of lane positioning myself over here. And what that means is I end up off the road, so that's something I'm going to have to get used to, being that this is left-hand drive. I know it's going to take a while to get there in first gear, but I'm so scared of crashing that I think I'm going to do this whole thing in first gear. I imagine it probably doesn't do well for my fuel consumption, but do you know what? Losing a bit of fuel is fine if it means I don't die and lose everything that we've just done for the last 43 minutes of my life recording this video. So again, if you know of an easy way to get to the shop, please, please let me know. Maybe I've done something wrong, because does it really take that long to just take a drive to the local shop? Because that makes this game absolutely astounding to me. There's a dog barking. But the dog's barking seems to always be with me. See, that it still, it sounds... It's, have we got, like, a dog following us or some shit? No, I just... I heard a dog. I hear the dog again. But we're still, like, travelling forwards. That dog will be like, bark, bark, bark. But this is like, bark, bark, bark. Not bark, bark, bark. <laughs> well, it's either that or we've got a dog in the back. I don't, but I don't know. I, I don't, I don't want to look. Oh, it's so annoying being in first gear. I know what you guys were saying about shift up the previous video now. Sod it, second gear, and just hope that we don't crash. I mean, the road right now is, is all right. It's not too bad. We should be okay. Oh, mind you, there's a big drop. There's a big drop. Uh, slow down, slow down, slow down. Ooh, I don't know where the next bit is. There's like a blind bit of hill. I don't like it. I don't want to lose my van again. That was too painful. Right, we're coming up on some signs, which makes me think that we might be close to the railway line. Oh. We're starting to see signs that we're near home. Right, so I don't know if trucks uh, or trains are in this game because obviously they might just be just really late. So I'm going to assume we're good. And I'm going to go this way home because I'm scared of taking that route. This is just the safer route that doesn't involve randomly falling into a ditch, which is my favourite type of route. Right, we should be coming up on this road here. This is the road we want. Please don't flip the van. I want to go down again. There we go. Start stopping the first. I'm not going to risk second gear. Actually, I'll sod it. I'll go second, but I'll just try and hold it back and just sort of tap. Oh, God. Actually, no. I'm going back to first. Sod it. I can't trust myself with the handling. I'm just going to end up sliding and toppling over. I can see it happening. So I think what I might actually do between now and the next video is I might take myself back to the shop to get more fuel. Actually, mind you, if we're going to be... Well, actually, what I might do is I might start building the car. I think I might look into how much of it... Because we've got loads of parts for the car already. So there's cer certain parts of the car that we can build now. So now that we've got all of our stocks, actually, I won't worry about fuel for now. I think in the next video, we might do some car building. 
Unless there's something else I've missed. Let me know, guys, if there's something I should have done or, you know, something I forgot. And then I'll, I might try and rectify that between now and the next video. Maybe I'll do that next video. I don't know. Wait, is... Hang on. Is this our home? Yes, this is our home. We're back home. Oh, wonderful. And all without headlights because I, I don't have... Oh, no, that's the neighbor I thought it is. That was the building I thought was my neighbor. So that's my house as well, is it? Or is that just a neighbor but the other building's mine? I don't know. But here we are, back home. Oh, I'm just going to park it right here. It doesn't really matter if I park it neatly. It's my home. I can do whatever I want. <sighs> wow. That's just... Uh, shut this up. So I might actually leave some stuff in the car, but I'm going to take the groceries in and the beer. So let's just grab this. Right, there's another set of beer. In fact, can we put this in the fridge? There we go. Let's try and put this in the fridge. Maybe beer goes off. May oh, maybe we could have just bought the milk because obviously we could stick the milk in the fridge. I didn't think of that. Right, here we go. In the fridge. Ah, nice. There we go. And then I'll just grab the other one put that in the uh, fridge as well. We've got nothing else to stick in the fridge, have we? Oh, mind you, I've got like pizzas and stuff. Oh, I'm sure I can leave that outside. <laughs> well, maybe we could just have warm beer. I don't know. Does this stuff sort of spoil if you don't put it in the fridge? I'm sure you guys can tell me. Didn't I? Oh, no, because I restarted the game, didn't I? Right, we're going to have to do that, aren't we? Right, let's just, let's just talk to this guy. Hello, I'd like to buy a flatbed of fireworks. You can deliver them anytime. Okay, it's the same guy. Let me just uh, pull that out. There we go. Apparently, it's just going to tell me that a bunch of times, so we needn't worry. Right, everything else is going to stay. Let's just take our shopping bag in. And somehow, we can actually, like, take everything out of the bag. Either by pressing F. Okay, by pressing F. Okay, well, that's a nice mess. <laughs> <laughs> right, hang on. Let me just get this one of beer. And I'll stick this on the side here. There we go. And where's our pizzas? We've got a bunch of sausages we could chuck in here. There we go. Stick all that in. I'll actually... I'm not going to keep doing this. We need to end this video. So first of all, I just need to grab some food. Let's just eat a bunch of that. Okay, that's made us thirsty and I don't want to die. So let's got ourselves a beer. Ah, lovely. Lovely beer. And another one. <laughs> just as much beer as we can take. Ooh, is everything getting brighter? Is that the sun coming back out? Okay, it's actually the sun coming back out. It was just actually not turning into night. It was just a little bit cloudy. Lovely. Well, that's going to be enough. Let me just shut all this up. I'm actually completely drunk right now. Where's the drunk speech button? It's K. Let's give that a try. Oh, apparently nothing. Right, let's just use this toilet and piss everywhere. Ah. <sighs> Well, what a day it's been, guys. 52 minutes of recording time. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but that is a long time for what I thought was going to be a quick... Just a quick just a quick video. Oh, come on. Stop dribbling out. Let's just, let's just pump all the piss out. There we go. Right. Let's just save and quit. So there we go, guys. That is it for this video. If you've enjoyed this video, please let me know by rating, commenting, and subscribing. If you got all the way to the end, and I mean this genuinely, I don't mean the people that skipped through and then just saw this last bit at the end. If you genuinely watch through, don't lie to yourself. Say the word rust. Say the word rust in the comment section. That's how I know that you're just an amazing person. You've watched the whole thing through. I'll be absolutely shocked if anyone has, but if you have, just, just let me know. But there we go, guys. That is it for this video. I'm actually quite tired, and even though we did nothing, it was just sort of mentally draining. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. <laughs>